If you've got a photo and want to give it a hyper contrasty, gritty look so you're not just upping the contrast but adding detail as well, you can do that by using a color channel in Photoshop. Now there are a lot of ways you can manipulate your photos with color channels. We're going to look at just this one and it involves the green channel. You can see you can cycle through your channels. Um, you get a lot of right a uh, light you get a lot of light in the red channel. You get some detail but less light in the green channel. And the blue channel gives you a lot of detail but not a lot of light. We're going to use the green channel for this effect. So I'm just selecting only the green channel, pressing Command A, Control A on a PC, and then Command C, Control C on a PC to copy. I'm selecting all and copying. Then I'm going to go back to the composite channel, or the composite RGB channel and then back to my layers panel. Now I'm going to paste the green layer now on top of my photo and then change the blending mode to overlay. And now I've got a very gritty hyper contrasty look. Now this is a bit much so I'm going to dial the opacity down to zero and then slowly bring it back in until I get it to a point where I want it. And so obviously a bit much but you bring it back down to around 40 50 percent and you get kind of a neat effect. This works well with photos that have enough light on the face. If you start using it on poorly lit subjects, it'll just make the background look really blown out and the subject look really dark. So unless that's what you're going for, you want to keep your subjects well lit when using this kind of effect in Photoshop. Although that's generally a good thing to remember for photography in general. So that's it. That's how you do it. And keep experimenting with color layers and blending modes to get some really neat effects with your photos.